Hello Aquarius, welcome on my channel Triple Two Tarot. I'm gonna do your bonus reading for end of March and starting of the April. Let's see what's happening for you, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, any placements. You have an Aquarius, you can write this reading. It's a general reading, take what resonates and leave the rest. You can book a personal reading, everything is given in description box. You can reach out to me if you want to. Link is even given below. Be careful from the scammers and fake accounts. I will never approach you. I will never contact you. So be careful. Okay. Let's go. Let's see it, Aquarius. What's happening for you? We have six of pentacles. That's really good. Two of cups. Wow. Okay. And we have a two of pentacles. Okay. So you could be seeing a lot of two, two. That could be your sign. We also have the moon. Ooh. You could be dealing with Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Someone is definitely watching you from afar. Another two. Two of wands. Yes. Two, two, two. So you're definitely on the right channel. Triple two tarot. Uh, I think Aquarius, there's something about to happen. Someone is, is definitely watching you, keeping the eye on you. You're on this person's mind. It's like they're thinking about it, how it would be if they will date you, how it would be if you will be together. I don't think so. This person told you right yet, okay, with the moon card. This could be a secret admirer or someone maybe wants to work with you. It could be a collaboration. But I don't think so. They came up. Seven of Cups reverse here. Yeah, Seven of Cups. This person definitely thinking about you. Even though they have options, they want to choose you. King of Wands, Fire Sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, you could be dealing with. Yes, the Tower. Okay, um, the Hermit. Mm, the, the Tower and the Hermit. Okay, this could be someone that you already had a breakup with. And they want to try again. Yeah, this is someone who realized after this separation, this could be someone who ghosted you. And it was really shocking for you or surprising for you. But let's say this could be also someone who were not looking for love and they fell in love. Interesting. For this person, it's really intense because with the moon card, they never experienced this type of love. They never experienced, maybe this person never told you verbally. You know, they never expressed it in a verbal way, like in the true words or true meanings, like I love you, I'm going to be with you, let's date together. This could be someone that I don't think so you dated. You felt the connection. It's mutual. This person or one of you could be trying to chase this situation or chase this person, but other person was juggling. Let's say two of pentacles and seven of cups. They were juggling their options. This person could be still confused, okay? They're still not sure if they are willing to be with you or if they are going to drop their all options for you, but I think they will. Look, ten of cups, because you make them happy. This could be also someone for some of you you had a family with. So, yeah. Could be your ex-husband or wife because I'm seeing the hermit and the tower and king of wands. This is definitely someone that you could have a family with. You could have a relationship with this person in the past. Ten of cups because I'm seeing happy memories. Look at this. So this person is definitely reminiscing the past with the two of cups and it, ten of cups. Like you, the way you make this person happy because I'm seeing also the kids here. So there could be a children involved. The way you make this person happy, I don't think so. This person can have this type of a connection with anyone. Okay, so this could be someone that you maybe in the past dated with this person or were in a situation ship. And others of you, this is someone that who is thinking about it, like how it would be if you will date because this person is planning ahead. They maybe want to settle down. The player fell in love. The two of wands. Yeah, the player. This person still have options. Okay, but it is going to be very shocking and surprising for you and for this person maybe already. They gone through this tower moment. I think they realized uh, that they did you wrong they they were wrong okay I think this separation was needed or this tower movement needed between you and this person yeah this could be an Aries I'm picking up Aries energy and also could be Leo this is your seventh house if it's Leo we also have a Virgo energy Pisces Cancer Scorpio a lot of water here though and could be Libra yeah look at this we have a ten of cups yes I think this is someone okay I'm think, seeing two scenarios. Okay, one, it could be someone that you already had a family with. Um, are you already, you know, you dreamt of, let's say you dream to have a family with this person. You plan it, but something did not go well. The tower moment happened, right? And others of you, this was a situation ship because it was an illusion. You always felt this connection intensely, the moon card. Your always intuitions told you that this person is into you, but then this person was afraid of telling you. So they could be a runner. So they ghosted you. They ran away from this connection because it was very intense. 
um, with the six of pentacles it, i'm strongly feeling it was not equal give and take it was not balanced in the past but now this person is definitely wanting to be with you wanting to try eight of swords i also feel this could be someone that um uh, that you you don't see them coming eight of swords you have for some of you you have no idea the moon and eight of swords you have no idea what the hell this person feel and think about you what the hell this person's intentions are this person really make your life stuck or confused you. Uh, they give you mixed signals. They confused you. They let you on for some of you. This is also someone you have no idea that who this person is because they are keeping the eye on you secretly. You have no idea. You're, you're blindfolded. So this person may be interested in you. Could be at a workplace. Okay, at your workplace with a six of pentacles, wherever you do work. So this person could be a foreigner or watching you from afar, a distance. I'm also seeing this could be someone that who maybe recently had a breakup with or they come out of a relationship or they recently gone through, not recently, maybe the previous year, like it's very, it was very unhealthy for them. They maybe got breakup, they come out of a relationship and let's say they could be a divorcee or they could become out of some type of a marriage or separation. For some of you, this is the sign that that's how you're going to know that this is that person. This person is definitely seeing you empress. They're seeing you definitely wifey material, husband material, whatever you are. Some of you, it's a work related because this person sees you very creative. They feel you very abundant. You're very attractive. They maybe want to collaborate with you or work with you because they feel like you both are going to be a good team because King of Wands is definitely talk about creativity. So this person maybe want to put you in their team. They feel like you will be the ISA 639. So this is definitely manifestation. This is also an angel number that you really need to see it. This could be the Empress also talk about Taurus and Libra. So there could be a Taurus or Libra. But we also have divine feminine here. So either you are the divine feminine or some of you, this person is the divine feminine. Masculine and feminine. Definitely your opposite attract. Interesting. Yeah, some of you, this is a mother involved here. You maybe already had a mother, you know, already had family or children with this person. This is also someone that you had a child with. So that person could be wanting to come back. Or let's say this person wants to have a child with you because they're seeing you as this motherly energy with the empress and moon. Or you give this person very nurturing, loving energy and, and they're craving your energy because you stop giving them the attention. Yeah, I think there's something happened here. Either you, the tower and the um, hermit energy, you ghosted this person and they're shocked and surprised. You walked away maybe from this person. You dropped them. You're like, no. Or this person did that, okay, for some of you. Look, I'm not even surprised. We have the snake, yeah. So someone was, I'm hearing, sneaky in this situation. There could be other woman or man involved here. For some of you, be careful. Either this could be a third-party situation. Could be someone's family involved or children or kids involved or baby mama involved here or you could be the baby mama. I don't know. There's definitely mother, children, family involved here, third-party. We also have, um, could be an enemy, so be careful. There could be someone, the people are watching it. So this person could be afraid of approaching you because they think that either you have someone else or the people are going to hate this connection. People are not going to approve it. Especially this person could have a fear of, you know, like approval of family, commitments, uh, or could be even uh, approval of community because for some of you, yeah, their, their work is going to affect by this. I don't know for some reason, but it's mostly it's their family. They're afraid of their family approval. This person, be careful because some of you, it's like, trust your own intuition. We have the passion. Yes, this person has a lot of passion for you. A lot of passion. This, this person is intense. I can see that. For some of you, be careful. This person maybe want to make you pregnant because we have the empress. So they have a lot of desire and passion for you. Want to make you pregnant. They're very, very attracted to you. Like, come on, you are the empress, the divine feminine. You're the goddess in this person's eyes. They definitely want to make you pregnant. We also have the love, yeah, with love, with passion. You look at this love and passion. This person is going crazy. Some of you, some of you, I'm telling you, this person want to cheat. I'm, 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 this is very specific, not going to resonate with everyone. And please don't be offensive. This person is willing to cheat on their partner for you. And they, they could already did that. For some of you, it's a third party. And you know it. It's a secret because their partner does not know about it. But if this person is already in a relationship, let's say they have a family, they have kids, they are willing to cheat their partner over you. But I hope you will make the healthy choices, you know, because this person has a lot of love and passion and desire for you. I can see that with the snake energy. They just want to do it. 
but be careful even though if this person coming back or situation shape or let's say something happen um this person still have like could be hate or jealousy or th this person's like there's definitely some type of a lingering energy coming from the past here we have a healthy choices here so i think the choice is your if you're going to allow this person or not you could be making healthy choices um you maybe have a healthy choices in love you're going to feel this person passion and love and desire for you there, there's no doubt about it some of you this person is keeping it high hidden because again it's it's something yeah look at this mask came up yeah the moon and mask yeah this person is keeping it hidden and secret because they know that once their secret is going to reveal everything is going it's like the blast the blast will happen in this person family um or in their culture in their religion i don't know there's some type of a um, lot of hate they will get it a lot of women will will hate it or maybe there's a woman going to hate you if you're going to choose this person especially if this person could be very attractive and charming creative artist they could be successful with the king of wands and the emperor empress they could be a leader they could be uh, obviously somehow someone very very i think have could be popular they maybe have a many option with the seven of cups but they choose they are choosing you it's mean you are going to get a lot of attraction from sneaky people haters jealousy okay uh, if they are they are he or she whoever it is or when you are coming together let's say if it's a business partnership people not going to like it because you both are going to be very successful but it's it's most romantic here i think it's romantic this person is keeping their love and passion and desire for you secret because of jealousy and hate and because of a lot of drama okay they're keeping it it's like they're masking up this could be someone who never told you how do they feel about you and this is going to be a blast and shocking for you look bottom of the deck this person want to date you again if this is a third person there's a family involved they're willing to date you know date you still they want to be with you but they're going to willing to it's like they're going to cheat on their partner so i hope that you will be aware of this third party or situation or whatever the choice that you will make but others of you i feel this is someone who want to date you and you will be su surprised and shocked because they are really serious they're really serious this can go really serious like this person wants to have a family kids everything all with you so that's your reading going to see you later bye